Have you ever wondered just how many galaxies are out there in the vast expanse of the universe? In this video, we're diving deep into the mysteries of the cosmos to answer the question, do astronomers know how many galaxies exist and how many can we actually see in the observable universe? The scale of the universe is mind-boggling and trying to pinpoint the exact number of galaxies it contains is a monumental challenge. Simplistically, one might think that the number of galaxies is the result of multiplying the size of the universe by the average number density of galaxies. But in practice, this is where things get incredibly complex. Astronomers and cosmologists grapple with estimating the size of the universe, a task that involves mind-expanding concepts like cosmic expansion and the vast distances between galaxies. Similarly, calculating the average number density of galaxies is a formidable endeavor, considering the incredible diversity of galaxies, from spirals to ellipticals and everything in between. In this video, we'll take you on a journey through the cosmos, exploring the latest advancements in our understanding of the universe's vastness. Here are some images of clusters of galaxies. They're exactly what they sound like. They're these huge collections of galaxies bound together by their mutual gravity. So most of the points that you see on the screen are not individual stars, but collections of stars or galaxies. We'll discuss the challenges astronomers face in making these calculations, as well as the cutting edge technologies and techniques they employ to peer deeper into the cosmos than ever before. Join us as we delve into the mysteries of the universe's galaxies and attempt to answer the age old question, just how many galaxies are there in the universe? Strap in for a cosmic adventure filled with wonder and discovery. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to stay updated on our latest explorations of the cosmos. The vastness of the universe is an endless source of wonder and intrigue. One of the most pressing questions we'll tackle is the enigma of the universe's size and the number of galaxies it holds. Recent research has led to a mind-bending revelation, the universe's total size may be infinite. This implies the existence of an unfathomable number of galaxies scattered across the cosmic landscape. It's a concept that stretches the boundaries of our imagination. Yet, there's a cosmic catch. Despite the potential for infinity, there exists a boundary, a limit beyond which we cannot see. This limitation arises because light from regions beyond this threshold has not had sufficient time to reach Earth since the momentous event known as the Big Bang. Enter the concept of the observable universe. Picture it as a cosmic sphere with a staggering diameter of approximately 92 billion light years and an awe-inspiring volume of about 410 nonillion, that's 410 followed by 30 zeros, cubic light years. Within this sphere, we, as observers on Earth, can peer into the distant corners of the universe and witness its wonders. The possibility of an infinite universe to the intricacies of cosmic expansion and the ever-elusive boundaries of our observable domain. We'll journey through cutting-edge research and mind-expanding theories that shape our understanding of the universe's vastness. Eventually, astronomers had uncovered the key to these objects, and in one fell swoop, our universe got a lot bigger. A lot. In 1920, there were two competing ideas about the universe. One was that our Milky Way was it, and that everything we saw was in it. The other was that the spiral nebulae seen in the sky were also like our Milky Way. Prepare to be captivated by the profound mysteries that lie beyond our reach as we unravel the enigmatic nature of the universe and strive to comprehend its infinite possibilities. Have you ever tried counting the stars in the night sky? Well, imagine trying to count all the galaxies in the universe. It's an astronomical challenge. Estimating the number density of galaxies presents its own problems. First and foremost, it's simply not possible to count every single galaxy in the vast cosmos. Why? Because it would take an eternity. Even with the best technology and an infinite amount of time, the universe's galaxies are so numerous that counting them is beyond human capability. My name is uh, Rob Kenneka. I am a professor of astronomy at the University of Cambridge. I'm an observational astronomer. I mainly work on galaxies, and I've done some work in cosmology, which is uh, the study of the expansion rate of the universe, some of the really big questions. But wait, there's more to this cosmic puzzle. Even the most powerful telescopes, like the Hubble Space Telescope, have their limitations. These incredible instruments can capture breathtaking images of distant galaxies, but they too face challenges. 
Some galaxies are too faint, like distant stars that are barely visible. Others are too small or too close to neighboring galaxies, making them tricky to spot. And there's another cosmic twist. Galaxies can be obscured by intervening material, like cosmic dust clouds, or they may not emit detectable light in wavelengths visible to the telescope. So, in the vast cosmic sea, countless galaxies remain hidden from our telescopic eyes. Now, you might wonder, why is estimating galaxy density so important? It's not just about counting stars in the sky. Astronomers use ingenious methods and data from telescopes, like galaxy surveys, to estimate galaxy density. In reading about astronomers, um, and it was, I think, uh, just an aesthetic attraction being curious and being good enough at math. By studying these elusive cosmic entities, we gain a deeper understanding of the universe's history, its expansion, and the forces that shape it. But that's the beauty of science and exploration. It's the quest to unravel the unknown, to peer into the cosmic abyss, and to seek answers to the grandest questions. When it comes to counting galaxies, it's not a straightforward task. The technique we use offers a lower limit, but doesn't give us the complete picture. This method provides us with a lower limit to the number of galaxies out there. One estimate suggests that in the observable universe, there are between 100 to 200 billion galaxies. That's an impressive number, but hold on, there's more to the story. What if I told you that some galaxies might have slipped through the cosmic cracks in previous studies? Enter the astronomers who dared to estimate the number of missed galaxies. Their calculations reached an astonishing total of two trillion galaxies in the universe. In school, to, to realize I could probably do it. Many people uh, in astronomy study star formation, and most of them are trying to understand how one star like our sun or one solar system like ours forms. That's a cosmic leap from our previous estimate, but as with all things in science, there's a twist. Recent measurements of the darkness of the night sky have thrown a cosmic curveball into the mix. These measurements suggest that our earlier estimate of two trillion galaxies might be an overestimate. It's a cosmic conundrum that keeps astronomers debating and recalculating. So, where does that leave us in our quest to tally the galaxies in the universe? The truth is, we're still uncovering the secrets of the cosmos, one galaxy at a time. The universe's grandeur is beyond measure, and our journey to understand it is an ongoing adventure. As we conclude this cosmic exploration, remember that the universe is a realm of infinite wonder and infinite questions. We may not have a precise number of galaxies, but that's the beauty of science. It keeps us curious, keeps us searching, and keeps us exploring. Thank you for joining us on this cosmic odyssey. If you found this video intriguing, don't forget to share it with your fellow cosmic enthusiasts.